What's going on everybody, I'm Drunken Hippo, and today we're playing The House by the Lake. A game found on Itch.io, another horror game, should be quick. Let's uh, jump into it, I'll leave a link, everything, and the description down below if you want to check it out. Just get into it and see what it is all about. Real quick, I've been studying some new editing techniques, so I can actually separate the face cam from the video, so I can do some interesting stuff like everyone else can do. Right now I'm limited to clicking on a computer and can do this, that's what I'm limited to. But, uh, enough of that. In 2009, a young man named Jason Lee was reported missing. The best friend of the victim informed the police that Jason told him that an individual had threatened him after a misunderstanding at the supermarket. The cameras inside the supermarket didn't catch any disagreements, but it didn't rule out an app outside argument. Jason's apartment was search, and no more information of his whereabouts was found until today. The case remains open, but after a year of Jason's disappearance, the case was assigned to the cold case unit since there hasn't been any new leads found. This damn storm won't let me sleep, and I think the TV may have turned on. Let me go and check it out. Press E to continue. I'm actually going to keep on looking for things. Yeah, chances are I'm not going to find anything in there. Thing in here. Got some Monday through Friday outfits. Nothing crazy. Oh, well, the light was off? Hold on, there's a key here. Grab it. Grab the key. Can't grab the key. Never mind. Can I grab my teddy bear? Alright, what's going on, guys? Got some very. Interesting pictures. I like those. Now that the TV is off, I should go back to bed. Press E to continue. Pressing E, is there... What? The F. The TV is back on. I hope the storm doesn't damage it. Thing is this, how would the storm turn the TV on and off? I'm just gonna wait out the storm. Time to brew some coffee. Gladly. I think I gotta turn the lights back on, though. The uh, lights were on. Never mind. Where are the lights? The kitchen. Got it. It's beautiful outside. Can't say there's a difference between low graphics and high graphics. Not really sure though. Nice fruit bowl. Got anything in the fridge? Ooh, cake and sweeties. Bunch of peppers. Alright, loud ass coffee maker with some original potato chips. Can I grab a knife while I'm at it? Considering, I mean, any horror game, really? But right now I'm just waiting for my coffee to be brewed. Can't eat anything. Can't do anything. To grab a coffee cup. The coffee finished brewing. Time to pour some in a mug and mix it with milk to give it a better taste before drinking it. Pour some into a mug. Alright, so I gotta pour some into a mug. Easy. Hmm, this coffee smells great. Just needs some milk and it's gonna be the perfect energy boost I need. I need to grab milk. It's perfect. I want some whipped cream in there. Get sweet. Pour some creamer. Coffee's fully mixed and ready. It's time to drink it. I really want to drink it. Press R to drink. The door opened. I'm gonna keep on drinking the coffee. Just turn the entryway on. What's up, girl? So what are you doing these days? Yeah, me too. I uh, just invested in GameStop. So uh, that's the thing. I'm basically a millionaire. You know, no big deal. Whatever happened to the TV? How much coffee can I drink? 
Just go for it. Drink all the coffee. Drink, 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 drink. I think I have to actually go back to my bedroom. I was like, I can grab my teddy bear. I heard a door close. Hi. You look scared. Jesus. I'm good. I'm good. Stamp store got me all shaken up. Look at this mess now. Let me grab the stain remover, sprayer, and a sponge to clean this mess up before my new carpet gets a permanent coffee stain on it. I just, I look like I shit myself. That's, that's basically what happened. I did see a sponge over here. It's kind of nice that it marks it out for you, though. Where's the cleaner? Under the sink? That is a... Kettle. More kettles. More kettles. Why? What? Why? Okay, I'm gonna stealth this man. With a sponge. I got a sponge, and I know how to use it. And now I got bleach. I don't stand a chance. I'll clean now. Let go. Put the cleaning supplies back under the bathroom sink. That's easy. I can do that. No, I want to keep the sponge, or the bleach. Now I need to grab the coffee mug from the floor and take it back to the kitchen sink. It's time to stand up like a real person. I can't believe I messed up my coffee. Back to the sink I go. Wash, wash, wash. Wash, wash, wash. I really didn't need to close. Close all these. I need to turn on... What do I need to do? Close that door. Can I go back to bed now? Night time. It's bedtime. Betty bye. Maybe in here. You can't scare me. Hmm. Really like that drawing. What the mother This is becoming a problem. Maybe I should just go back to bed. Or stop ignoring it and face the problem head on. I'm gonna face the problem head on. What the mother who let their red-headed stepchild out? And you... <laughs> he's got rabies. Okay, this dude, he's definitely got rabies. Yep. I'm coming for you now. Uh, let me find... Can I grab a cup? A knife? Anything? I'll grab the milk jug for all I care. All right, bare knuckle fighting it is. Where you at, you little bastard? I know you're here. To the right. Ending two out of two. Oh my gosh, rabid child is on the loose. Okay, so I'm on run two out of two. I don't think that happened last time, did it? I don't know if it did. I can't remember, to be honest. All right, so this is this is rabid child number two. I know, I know. 
Now, since that raccoon went and ran off, we're going for the first ending. We have to go to bed, basically. That's the only difference, I believe. And we're going to see what happens from here. The hell do I need a key for? I want to go to bed. Let me go to bed. A gun. Oh, I want. Give me the gun. I don't understand. I'm going outside. You have to play in this after your uh, third time through. This isn't that bad. And I just noticed the plane, or uh, sorry, I just noticed the painting fell because I had time to turn all the lights on. Cue rabbit kid. There he is. So I'm not going to cue him running to the window. Which in turn, I can't grab the key. I can go to bed and get the one out of one ending after playing this three times. I know sleeping isn't the best solution, but the alternative will mean I won't get to see you anymore. Well, that's sad. That's sad. So that was The House by the Lake, a story about a rabid, red-headed kid with rabies. <laughs> I don't really know the intention, I'm sorry. It was just figuring out the cues for the endings that kind of got me. But it was short, it was good, it scared me quite a few times. I liked it, so props to the developer on that one. Uh, regardless, thank you for watching. Check it out on Itch.io. I'm Dragon Hippo. Hopefully I'll see you in the next one. Bye.